Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to prove dou of x, y, z by dou of u, v, w as u square into v. So first of all, we need x, y, z in terms of u, v and w. So we will take three equations, x plus y plus z is equal to u and y plus z equal to u, v and z is equal to u, v, w. So what we are going to do is, in this place of y plus z, I am going to substitute u, v. So this will become x plus u, v equal to u. So x is equal to u minus u, v. Now we need y in terms of u, v, w. So here we got x in terms of u and v. In the same way, we need y in terms of u, v and w. So in place of this z, we are going to substitute this. So we get y plus u, v, w equal to u, v. So y equal to u, v minus u, v, w. And z is already in terms of u, v, w. So now we are going to find dou of x comma y comma z by dou of u comma v comma w. So this is equal to dou x by dou u and the other element of the first column is dou y by dou u then dou z by dou u then dou x by dou v dou y by dou v dou z by dou v then dou x by dou w dou y by dou w dou z by dou w so we have to evaluate this determinant now let's fill all the elements the first element x with respect to u so first element will be 1 then minus b because u differentiation is 1 then this y with respect to u so we get b minus and again bw is constant then z with respect to u bw is constant then coming to the second column this we have to differentiate with respect to b so we get only minus u then here with respect to v we get u minus u w then this with respect to v the constants will be u and w then coming to the third column with respect to z this will be 0 and here with respect to w so this doesn't have w these both are constants so this is 0 and this is minus u v and this is with respect to w this is u v so we are going to evaluate this determinant so the first element is 1 minus v into we have to multiply this so u square v minus u square v w then plus u square v w the second element is u into we have to take these two so let's write it in the next row so plus u into u v square minus u v square w these two then plus u v square w now we can cancel the positive term u square v w and the positive and negative term in the same way u v square w minus u square w and after this we have to multiply this one here we get u square v then minus u square v square similarly if I multiply this u here we get u square v square once again we can cancel the positive term and negative term and finally we left with this is u square into v so in the question they are given prove that this expression is u square v and we got it hence prove 